In this video, let us see how to download resume from resume.io for free. You can see that I have a resume here, but when I click on the download PDF, you can see that it asks me to use the 7 day trial version which is cost around 247 or ask me to upgrade to a premium version which goes up to 4000 rupees. Let us see how to download this resume from resume.io for free. Let's get started. We're gonna use this repository. So the credit goes to this user Philippe all. So the all the codes belongs to him. I don't know anything here. If you want to support this user, just give a star to this repository. I will provide the link of this repository in the description. You can check that out. If you scroll down, you can see that it says how to run the application. First, we need to clone the repository. Let me copy this first command. Before that, you need to have the git install in your machine. If you haven't, just go to the Google and type git download. Click on the first result. Depending on your operating system, install the git. After you install, continue add the video. Let me copy this command. I'm gonna open this folder and open the terminal here. If you are using the Windows, open the command prompt in any folder and paste the command and press enter. You can see that now we have successfully cloned the repository. So now we have cloned the repository. This is the project files you can see on the left hand side. The next thing is to jump into the project folder. Further copy the second command and paste it in the terminal. You can see that now we are in the resume.io2 PDF. Next, we need to build the image. For that, just open a new tab and type docker download. Depending on your operating system, download the docker desktop then continue add this video. I have already installed the docker. If you haven't, docker available for all the operating systems. You can see that here. If you are using the Windows, just download the Docker software for Windows, then continue this video. Docker available for Mac and Linux and also for this Windows. Download it and install it and continue ahead this video. So I have already installed Docker. If you type Docker now, you can see if you get any message similar to this, then you have successfully installed the Docker on your machine. Let me clear the screen. So just open the repository and copy this command to build the image. And paste that here and press enter it will take some time to build the docker image it will download all the metadata it needs for the image the first time only it downloads the image after that you can just start the docker in just a few seconds just give you a few minutes now as you can see now the docker image has been built successfully if you want to see the image type docker images here we have the resume i to pdf docker image let me clear the screen docker images let us see how to run this docker image now for that we have the another command run the container copy that command and paste it here you can see that now the container has been started successfully and it is running on local force on port 8000 let's open this website now local force port 8000 so let me open this website in a new tab right click on it open it in new tab here we need to provide something called the rendering token we need to get this from the resin.io or then just go to resin.io and go to the dashboard this is the dashboard now to get the rendering token right click and select inspect i'm gonna switch to different browser now because using the microsoft edge you can easily find the rendering token so let me switch to microsoft edge now so just right click and select the inspect here just click on this network tab you can see the symbol is similar to wi-fi click on that network tab here we need to refresh the page now Click on the refresh page. Just give you a few minutes so that the website will load it fully. So this is our response now. If you scroll down, you can see something like resumes. Search for that data. So let me scroll down. So here I have the resumes here. When you hover that, you can see it says HTTPS resume.io slash API slash app slash resume that. So select this data and in the response tab, select the response tab. Here we have the rendering token. Let me Minimize this. We have the rendering token here. We need to copy this token. Again, let me tell you, in the network tab, you can find something like resumes. Here in the resumes, you have the rendering token. Copy that token. You can see that this is the resumes. Under the resumes, select the response. Click on the resumes and select the response and get the rendering token. And paste the rendering token here. Let me paste it now and select the download. As you can see, it successfully downloads the resume from the resume.io for free without paying anything. If you want to save this, click on the save button. Let me give you a name. Resume.resume. 
I found mine that PDF. This is my PDF. Let's save that file now. Let me open that file now. So here we have our resume that we have downloaded now. Right click and open it. I'm gonna open this with Google Chrome. So we have successfully saved the resume to our desktop. You can see it have all the pages. The text is also selectable. You can see that. And the links will also work properly. If you select any link, let me click the link in. You can see that the page is redirected to the link link. So this is how you download the racing from racing.io for free. If you want to download the cover letters, let me go to the racing.io. If you want to download this cover letters, again you have to find the rendering doc. So again select the cover letters. I'm gonna use the Microsoft Edge now. I have switched it to it. Just right click and select the inspect and select the networks tab and refresh the page now to get the responses. Refresh the page now. Here we have the resumes. This is what we used earlier to get the rendering token for resumes. The response you can see that rendering token for resumes. Below that we have the cover letters. Inside that we have the rendering token for the cover letter now. Let's scroll up. Here we have the rendering token for cover letter. Let me copy that rendering token. When you hover the rendering cover, cover letters you can see resume.io slash ap slash app cover letters this is for resin and below it for the cover letters so let me clear this rendering token paste the rendering token that we have copied for cover letter and click on download it will download the cover letter as you can see successfully fetch the cover letter from the resin.io let me minimize this you can see that it successfully detects the resin you want to save that again click on this save button give me a name for your file this case cover letter I found mine let's save that file now let me open up the folder let's open the cover letter with chrome so this is our cover letter now when you go to the terminal now you can see that the docker container is still running if you want to stop this just press Control plus C, it will stop the Docker container. If you type the Docker ps A command, consider the container has been stopped 4 seconds ago. Now when you go to the page, when you refresh the page now, it says unable to connect because we have stopped the Docker container. If you want to again start that, just type Docker ps A. We're gonna copy the container ID. Let me copy the container ID. To start the container again, just type docker start and paste the container ID and press enter. Now when you refresh the page, you can see that the resume.io has been loaded again successfully. Now if you want to stop this, just use the command docker stop and paste the container ID again. Press enter. Now when you refresh the page, it says again unable to connect. So this is how you download the racing from racing.io for free using this docker method. Again the credit goes to the GitHub user Philippe all. So this is for this video and I will continue in the next one.